We've found that the Bogong moth is actually able to use the stars as a, as a true compass to find a direction relative to north. Uh, it's actually incredible that a small insect is able to do this, to actually travel on a journey using the stars with this tiny, tiny nervous system that they have, very small eyes. Their brain has a volume about a tenth of that of a grain of rice. So we're not talking about a lot of neurons. Um, and this journey, if we were to convert it into body lengths, would be equivalent to a human making a circumnavigation of the entire Earth twice. And they do this journey two times during their life, once on the way to the mountains, and once after the summer when they return to the breeding areas um, in the autumn. So the way we've done this research is that we've um, trapped uh, moths while they're migrating uh, using a big light and a sheet uh, out in the wilderness and then we capture the moths, we take them back to our special lab which is, has been built uh, especially for these experiments out of completely non-magnetic materials because we know they have a magnetic sense and we don't want to interfere with that. So this is the first example of an invertebrate animal that is able to use the stars in this way. It's only humans with the help of a sextant and some species of night migratory birds which seem to have this ability.